An Italian member of parliament from populist Matteo Salvini's League Party was hospitalist this week after a migrant threw missiles at moving vehicles along a major Italian motorway. League MP Claudia Gabeto was injured and taken to hospital after the migrant, a 22-year-old Egyptian national, allegedly threw an object at her vehicle, smashing the windscreen and causing glass to hit her in the eye as she was traveling with her family for their summer holidays. The incident took place on Friday morning at around 9.30 a.m. on Italy's important and busy A1 motorway, known as the Autostrada del Sol, between Lodi and Casal Puster Lengo. Two men aged 22 and 65 were also injured as a result of the Egyptian throwing objects at vehicles, IL Journal reports. The Egyptian migrant is said to have been taking a high-speed train when he pulled the emergency brake and got off then made his way to the busy motorway where he started throwing various projectiles, including throwing a stone at a train, forcing it to stop and causing delays on the Milan-Bologna line. When police arrived on the scene, the 22-year-old threatened to kill himself with a sharp object but was subdued by officers using a taser. In total, at least 20 vehicles were impacted by the migrant's actions. Following his arrest, the Egyptian was taken to a mental health center in Kodogno while prosecutor Domenico Chiaro stated that the man will face various charges, including attacking transport security. League leader Matteo Salvini commented on the incident on Twitter, saying, Solidarity with the people involved, a hug to a mother from the League who was injured by shattered glass. I can't wait for some security to return to this country. The incident is just the latest case of a migrant causing havoc in Italy in recent months and comes after another migrant from Morocco was caught on video engaging in a machete attack in Turin. The 28-year-old Moroccan was also said to have issues with mental health and had been involved in several other violent incidents prior to when the footage was filmed in early June.